Welcome to Jimmy's World, where we're taking this airplane that hasn't been in annual for 22 years and we're getting it back up to speed and dealing with wires. Sit rep, I am hooking up the power and ground and lighting for the harnesses today. And I decided to open this up since the engine monitoring is gonna go here, the 155 there, all the stack of the other stuff, autopilot, audio 430 transponder and that so that leaves this whole area open and what i did was create a plate that's going to go right there like that i'm going to put screws on here so that it can open up like that and on this side of it we'll have the box so the box will be mounted kind of like that on there and then it'll go in like that and if I ever have any issues we can just pop those off unplug them and look at them and get to it right from there that should work out really well and it'll keep everything up nice and high away from the yoke so whenever it moves no wires or anywhere near that thing Woohoo! coming together hey we're starting to make some progress we've got the VORs in Getting some harnesses wired up and it's super easy so far just got a hot wire a lighting wire and a ground and that's it and now we're gonna start putting in some trays and stacks and get everything going waka, waka, waka. so excited ran into my first problem in the installation on the first thing i uh, tried to install the audio panel with this thing oh get it in there this is a whole new connector. And this one, this part right here, the bottom piece, the gold piece, is gotta come off in order to use their new one. However, you can't take it off because it's one piece. In order to get this one off, you'd have to cut it. And I ain't about to be cutting next to a brand new stinking harness and risk nicking one of these wires or something like that so guess what i'm using the old style with the backing block like okay there's another one ready to go in got it all back in the back plate that's there that's there just do it up on the bench here and then pop it in and that was i don't know just a couple of minutes sweet oh you know that last video where i said or that last part where I said, no, I'm gonna wait until we, you know, get everything in and the panel's going, who am I kidding? I'm impatient. I wanna see something turn on and see some progress already. Come on. So here we go and cue the music. see it because it's dark back in there but that was really frankly easiest thing I've done on this whole plane now let's turn on moment of truth here we go there's that and get my little switch okay so that comes on hey Comes on. Hey. Oh. <laughs> Stuff is turning on. Oh. Yes. Oh. Hey, look, it's doing its its initializing test. Yes, V lock, GPS. Hallelujah! And we gotta go in and configure all this stuff, which is not a big deal. The screen looks ever so tiny bit slightly crooked. I don't know if it's from where I'm sitting down here or what. Okay. 
so stuff is turned on we got one little crystal out on that nap but not a big deal hey look at that look at that look at hair look at hair now it's time to configure things play with things and see if we can't get some noise happening all right huh <sighs> Boy, that feels really good after all that headache. And honestly, the hardest part about this entire process was removing the old stuff and cleaning up all the old wiring. And I still have some of it to clean up. Some of it's still hanging around out here that is not being used or that's not, um, was just extra and never used. So now I go ahead and I'll finish my plate to mount it here. And then we'll get the fuel or the uh, engine monitoring system make a little plate here make a little plate to cover up the gaps uh, and shoot we can start putting stuff back together Holla! yeah 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 and if you're crazy and you're weird and you like fun projects and you know a little dorky like myself hit that like hit that subscribe button leave a comment I love seeing your, your suggestions, your comments. A lot of you have a lot of experience in uh, the AMP and the mechanical world and a lot of ownership, airplane ownership world. I love hearing your comments, your questions. I try to answer all of them as best I can. So thank you and let's continue the journey. This is one giant step and one small flight for plain kind. That's stupid. We'll we'll edit that one out. That was terrible. Oh, I love seeing lights and buttons and things that are doing what they're supposed to do.